storm is, is the culmination of all the work that I've been doing for probably the last 15 years. This play in particular started resonating with me very deeply because I wanted to realise my own training within the life that I was leading myself, often in the city, in an urban context. So I started to devise a technique that you could get results in a very short amount of time to tell a story. Between five days and ten days, we have a template, we have our four main protagonists, and we lead a brand new uh, co uh, constellation of students from all different kinds of backgrounds through a series of exercises and training days where they get used to the ensemble training, the music, they learn new songs, they learn new movements, new formations, new ways of interacting with space. And then we learn structures of scenes. The training uh, was based in a lot, a lot of hours with the ensemble work. Chorus work, actually, that nobody's a star. And you're always just listening to what is happening out there, what the uh, protagonists and the main actors are doing, and just responding to it. And, you know, you're not there to take focus, you're there to respond and you're to help, you're there to assist the actors. As a chorus, you can, you, it's you, as we said, it's your job to give to the actors that are telling the story that have the language. But at the same time, we have to stay alive within what we're doing. We have to be there for them. We have to connect. And to incorporate people who come in for the first time who are new to the training and know that they have five days to incorporate this training into their body and incorporate this training into the story then. Um, that really speaks volumes of the It's very intense, it's very playful, the results come out really quickly and it's a huge joy to see how people change in such a short amount of time. It's not as hard, difficult as it sounds actually, every human body has this pumping heart. This is why Shakespeare was good because he found this pumping heart in his text. This work for me finds this pumping heart in the body and you can share and you meet immediately. When an audience goes to see a Shakespeare show, with its uh, classic text that at times they are looking for how beautiful is the iambic pentameter going to be or how great is the voice and the tone that can actually give this particular text. I didn't feel I was dealing with that here. It's a rendition that takes the premise of what we have in the Tempest and just shakes it about right? and gives it uh, its own level of musicality, its own level of, of in Garjanitsa we were working a lot toward creating this natural environment for theatre. So I was in London and I uh, get very inspired by spoken word poetry and the underground scenes. And for me the closest to the essence of what I loved, one about what I learned in Poland, but two what I understand is really like the raw edge of what was so brilliant about Shakespeare in the Elizabethan period. So if we return to The Tempest, I think it's a very exciting dynamic place to land on this island and reconsider what the family structure is.